Greetings everyone, this is Danny from hardtravel.com, your celebrity cruise experts, and today I'm on board the beautiful brand new Celebrity Beyond. This particular room is an accessible edge stateroom with infinite veranda, which means those guests with mobility needs can book this particular room. You're gonna get quite a bit more space and of course all those accessible features. Now I'll tour that in just a minute and point those out, but when you're ready to book this beautiful room or any room or suite with Royal Caribbean, Celebrity or Silver Sea, make sure you do it right on hardtravel.com. You can take advantage of our interactive deck plans to pick the perfect room or suite for you, your friends, family, or group at an incredible value, and get the hard travel signature service every step of the way. Now let's tour this beautiful room. Now when you walk in the door, I did want to point out that you do have an electric door. So you've got a button to press here, it's going to open up automatically, it's motorized. And then outside when you tap your key card, it's also going to open up and hold for about 10 seconds. Now on the other side here, I wanted to point out this panel. Now you can control the temperature, the lighting, and of course the blinds from here. But if you download the Celebrity Cruises app before you arrive here on board, it's gonna make checking in online at home seamless. Of course, when you get to the pier, it's gonna make that a lot quicker as well. And when you arrive in your room, you can use the app to control all those features, plus the television. You can even use it as a room key, which I really appreciate because I always manage to leave my room key in the room. Now I did want to point out that this is an extra wide door to get through with a chair. And then as we come in, you have a pretty decent turning radius here. There's a bigger one on the far side. I'll take you there in a moment. Now as we open up the bathroom, I did want to point out that this is not an automatic door. So it's something that would have to be manually opened. And then as you go in, there is a nice smooth threshold here. And then as we head further in, you're going to find it's a pretty nice large space. So you've got the toilet tucked behind. You're going to have the emergency pull string and also the grab bars here. And then on the other side, you're gonna find the vanity. Now it's a little bit lower than what you're gonna find elsewhere on the ship. Intentionally, you do have storage on the vanity, a little bit down below, more up here as well. Now I wanted to point out the shower. So it's a pretty good size shower. You do have a shower chair, but with the handle so far away, it may be a little bit difficult depending on your mobility needs. So make sure that you pay attention to that when choosing the perfect room or suite for you. You do have the grab bars in there as well as you would expect. And one thing that I did notice is that you're gonna have all the bath amenities are a little bit higher up. So you may need to get some extra ones that you can have them bring down for you. Now, as we head further into the room, you're gonna find quite a bit of storage here. You've got hanging storage across and down below. You're gonna find those extra comfy celebrity bathrobes and slippers. Now, I did wanna point out they've got a pull bar, so you pull it down. This is gonna come down to a lower level for you. Now, just opposite of that, you're gonna find a bit more storage here. Once again, you've got shelving units here for storage. You're also gonna have an umbrella to use on board, and you have your safe, perfect size for passport or wallet, and it is down a little bit lower. Next up, you're gonna find the bed. Once again, it is lower as well, which you would expect in an accessible room. On either side, you've got the emergency buttons. You're also gonna have a USB charger, two of them on this side, and a US plug on the other. The beds do separate into two twins. In that case, the nightstand would move to the middle and you'd be able to have a little bit more separation of space. Now across from the bed, you're gonna find a large flat panel TV. It's fully interactive, so you can see what's going on throughout the ship in addition to watching television. And as we continue further along, you're gonna see this is where the room really opens up. So you do have a good pathway here for a chair based on your needs. And I wanted to point out that you have a writing desk that doubles as a vanity here. Now this can be removed for you as, as needed. You can actually push this in as well if you want a little bit more space. And then you have that large mirror that you can use to get ready. Next to it, you're gonna find your mini fridge underneath. You're also gonna find drawers for storage here. And I love these charging boxes. So you've got two USB chargers, two US and a European plug. It's perfect for charging your devices. You can run the cords through here, close it, and you have a really nice tidy charging station. You're gonna have your sofa over to the other side here. Of course, you can use that to watch television. It's also positioned beautifully to take advantage of the ocean views. Now, in the name of this particular room, you're gonna have the infinite veranda. So what I really appreciate about what they've done with this is, you, of course, you have furniture out here on the veranda. So you can close these doors, close it off, press a button, and then the entire window is gonna come down. So the room can become the balcony or just the balcony area, if you have it closed out, would be your balcony. Of course, you've got two chairs and a table here. Perfect to have a nice cup of coffee or tea in the morning. Maybe a cocktail or glass of wine in the evening and enjoy the beautiful ocean views and that fresh ocean air. Now, I did wanna point out that you've got a little bit of a bump on the threshold here. They can move the furniture based on your personal needs, but what we've found with this particular room is if you separate that out just a little bit, if anybody's in a chair, either a power chair or a manual chair, you can go right up here and then come right back as needed, and then you've got a great turning radius behind. 
Now I did want to point out that this particular one is right next to the elevator bank, which is where we think all accessible rooms should be. So you can avoid the hallways when they're cleaning and things along those lines. Easy access is key. Now, when you're ready to book this room or any room or suite with Royal Caribbean, Celebrity, or Silver Sea, make sure you reach out to the expert Har Travel. We know the space is inside and out. We have an amazing relationship with the cruise line, and we know we can help craft the cruise vacation of a lifetime for you, your friends, family, or group at an incredible value, and get the Har Travel signature service every step of the way.